Yeah, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I know, I know, I know. Look at my face. Make all the fun you want. But I'm here for one reason and one reason only, and that's to give you guys my official build for NBA 2K22 Next Gen. Now, we did do a creation of this build, but I never went through my SIGs, my dunk packages, my animations, my appearance, nothing. So today's video is all about that. So if you guys been wondering where iPod been with this video, here it is for you guys now. Now listen, I got a strict schedule that I want to try to keep for this video. We're going to go over all the animations first. Then we're going to go over the appearance. We're going to go over my tattoos, my face. If you guys notice, I have my phone right here. Yes, we will be scanning my face in the game. And that is why I cut my luxurious beard and I look like Chase Money. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and hop into the video. Oh, hell no. King Kong, King Kong, King Kong, Abba, King Kong. All right, so before we get into the animations, I want to actually show you guys something real quick. This is usually the top comment on YouTube um, attributes. Let me go ahead and show you guys all of my attributes. This is what the build looks like at 95 overall. All I have left is a little bit of mid range shot and a little bit of strength to put up on this build to get to 99. Let's talk about badges for a moment. I have three different setups. I have a toxic setup, I have a park setup, and I have a wreck setup. If you guys notice, toxic and park is not set up, mainly because I've been playing a lot of wreck lately. Um, if you guys notice, I put Lob City Finisher on simply because we will be trying out a new set of um, offense soon. So that's why I put that on. If you guys notice, um, I do have Sniper on gold. Um, quick tip, uh, Ronchi told me about this. If you have a big 6.8 or 6.9 and higher, Sniper on gold works better than hall of fame but don't quote me though um and also limitless spot up some people saying that that badge doesn't work but we will be trying it out in wreck because we have to beat some of these zones if you guys notice a lot of people have been playing up against zones and getting torched because nobody's staying at the hash um playmaking um i have everything that i need to make my team a little bit better i got bailout i got dimer glue hands unpluckable needle threader break start and bullet passer then i got downhill on gold Another quick tip, if you are one of those people that are out on a break and you want to get finishing badges, you need downhill. Trust me. It don't matter if you're a guard, don't matter if you're a big, don't matter if you have an 88 speed, a 90 speed, you need downhill. Um, as far as defensive badges go, um, my badges are all over the place simply because I'm all over the place. Um, I have to rebound. I have to defend on the, the wings. I have to defend up top. I have to press full court. And I have to try to beat guys that are uh, probably four inches taller than me for rebounds. All right. And remember, my dude is 6'9". Now, um, let's go into the my player animations. Um, if you guys notice, um, for jump shots, yes, my jump shot is 98 and Rudy. It has not changed for probably the last three years. And I have it on the fastest. All right. Now, um, what you would want to do is if you're one of those people that can't play on the fastest, you can go ahead and bump it down to quick. I do have that option available, but um, I use the fastest because um, Sniper is godly. <laughs> All right. Um, I use Gilbert Arena's free throw simply because legit, I use real player percentage. I don't time none of my free throws at all. All right. Layup style is default. Dunk style is go crazy. I'll show you guys my dunk style creator in a moment. And this is for big. So like, if you guys want to check any of these six, these are for people that are six, nine and up that don't have no packages for nothing. Dribble pull up Curry, spin jumper, hop jumper pro. Uh, post phase is Kobe. Um, I actually can hit a couple post phase without even having a high post control and stuff like that. But I'm not going to be doing any of those post phase until I get my midi up. Post hook is Kareem, of course. Um, and post hop shot is Kobe. Dribble styles. I know a lot of people always want to say, we want to see your six. We want to see your dribble moves. It don't matter if I dribble, dude. Honestly, I'm going to get ripped probably seven to eight times out of 10 if I'm up top dribbling up against a guard. But if I'm going up against a big that probably don't have a high still, um, fundamental dribble style is probably one of the best simply because it gives you this nice escape where you can um, kind of like not speed boost, but have a quicker first step out of it. Or you, when you do that step back, if they play off you because they think you can't shoot, you can pull up for three. Um, I don't need to go into any of these because none of those really matter. 
But um, in game celebrations, I got Big Shot Bob on um, for when I green jump shots at the wreck and at the park. Um, mainly, this is like this so that I can go ahead and get a head start back on defense. I don't have this on for any other reason besides that. Um, as far as the dunk celebration, um, I got too small on. So when I do dunk the ball, especially in a wreck, I want to stay where I am so that I can press the defender after getting maybe a fast break or even getting a backdoor cut or something like that. Too small allows me to stay right there inside of an animation until the guard gets the ball and it allows me to do a full court press. Um, everything else does not matter. Uh, the park flop is split um, simply because we don't have that many animations this season, all right? As far as show off animations, I really don't care about none of this stuff, but um, I got slow mo for like when we start in games. Um, I got the hello powder toss. I do use dice roll for thumbnails. I ain't gonna cap on my 1 million VC uh, shopping spree video in the park. I use that for a thumbnail. Um, Not worried about city dribble stuff. Not worried about that. Yo, you guys already heard me what I said about jump shot creator. Uh, let's talk about my dunk style for a minute, man. So as far as standing dunks go, you guys notice that I have one hand under basket regular, um, mainly because I don't like two handed dunks. I, I, I feel like the defender, whether it's CPU or AI, they dunk two handed dunks much more when under the rim. So I went with one hand under basket regular, okay? As far as rim pulls, um, I went with pro under basket rim pulls. I'm gonna actually test this out in a wreck um, for the next like 10 games and I'll, I'll give you guys my uh, thoughts on it. But I'm telling you now, do not equip, and I repeat, do not equip elite basket rim pull-ups this is one of the worst dunk packages in the game because it gives you the same back scratching animation every single time and guess what people block it coming down every single time or you just get blocked outright um let's see athletics another thing take off two-handed under basket athletic it gives you another back scratch especially that one yeah it looks fast it looks really really fast but guess what they block those too. <laughs> All right. They block those as well. So I would go with one handed under basket athletic, which I'm testing right now. If I do a windmill more than anything, I'm taking this package off. If I don't do these real quick, real fast one handed dunks, I'm taking this off. All right. Um, as far as signature dunks, I went with Westbrook simply because this is the one where my limitless takeoff will actually take me off further away and I'll be able to, you know what I mean, dunk the ball before anybody can come up and block me from behind or even strip me. You know I mean, my takeoff is crazy. Um, as far as alley-oops go, I do have the pro alley-oops equipped. Um, I have also the flashy park alley-oops equipped as well. And the reason why I have the flashy ones is because sometimes they take um a little bit longer to actually like go in the circle where you got to press square for the timing so they actually work for me um as far as two foot moving dunks if you notice i don't have any dunks off two feet i do not recommend dunking with stuff off two feet i always recommend one foot all right now as far as one foot dunks i got front clutches equipped you know what i mean that's the that's the easiest one where you out on a break you know what i mean you want to get that dunk off and you don't want nobody to block you uh quick drops off one is another one that launches you from like the free throw line with a uh sky dunk um you'll probably see it here um where is it that one right there that's the dunk animation you usually always get which is really really good um, I got reverses on, but only for baseline reverses. I don't have any other reverses on because I, I don't trust doing a reverse and then actually being able to get blocked like that right there. If a big comes over and tries to help on those clutches, he might he might block that. So I, I didn't want to trust putting those on. And of course, flashies off one is probably a, a good dunk package. I've used it in the park plenty of times, and I haven't been uh, blocked yet with this package. So pretty, pretty good. And uh, let's see, let's go into jump shot splashes real quick. Um, as far as my jump shot splash, I do have the star, I have the electric, and you guys already know from my old videos, I got the little cash machine. Uh, type joint as far as runway animations i really don't care about those but i got confidence spin uh runway walk and i got the thespian that's the joint where you, you know what i'm saying do that little tiktok move or whatever now um let's talk about appearance for a moment 
Um, if you guys did watch my 1 million VC video, you guys know that I got a lot of stuff, um, especially sneakers. I got like a ton of shoes from Jordan that I, that I got. Like, look, I got 13 pairs of ones, like for no reason. I got seven pair of fours. Like I just went crazy on that. But what I actually want to show you guys is my actual face scan. So what we're going to do is we're going to scan our face right now. And I'm hoping 2K don't sell me on a look. All right. You know what I'm saying I'm just I'm just I'm praying. All right, that's all I can pray for. Building your my player's unique scanned head. This will take a few minutes. Once your build is complete, you can continue to customize it. All new head builder. Head builder. Head builder. Head builder. All right, we have 50 per 50 percent. Okay, 75 percent without crashing. Oh, we might have some here. Big dumb ugly motherfucker. That boy ugly hell boy. All right, so peep chat. Um, I forgot to show you guys this, but I want to show you all my tats. Um, I spent a pretty penny on these tats, so please do not laugh at me while I show you guys these chat these tats. All right, so what I ended up doing was I used a lot of M's and I's and uh some full moons, and then I went with the lightning and all that for my arms. I put a bulldog in my chest and I also put the basketball on my back. So yeah, black neck, black hands, all this blackness, black of the black. And I look good. You know what I'm saying? What y'all think it chat? Hold on. Matter of fact, let me do my goddamn dice roll. Hold on. You know what I'm saying? Do my motherfucking dice roll. Only you niggas, bro. You know what I'm saying? What y'all think chat? WL for the test, man. WL for the test, chat. Yeah, man. W-O-L, man. Let me do Let me go do my goddamn Gatorade powder toss, baby. Let's get it right. You know what I'm saying? All in all, chat, I hope you guys enjoyed your time here. Make sure you guys hit that like button if you really did enjoy it. Um, Also, make sure y'all leave comments, man. Let me know. Is my tattoos nice? What y'all think about my animations, my jump shot? What y'all think about my face scan? Let me know, man. I think I think I'm back, man. Also, Logo Pod is definitely back in the building, man. So, you know what I mean? We're gonna be getting a whole lot of games at the park real soon. We on our wreck ground right now, but trust me, we're gonna be we're gonna be grinding this logo, man. Believe that, believe that. But I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Oh, before I go, season projects. I wanted to tell you guys that I'm actually a level 31. So I know a lot of people probably was gonna be asking that as well inside the uh video. And yes, that means I can go ahead and ride my inline skates into the sunset. So I'll see y'all at level 40 when I get that goddamn go-kart, man. I know it was a lot of information in this video, and I hope you enjoyed. Peace, y'all.